Are you ready? Okay. This is Clara Tyler reporting live from a chaotic scene here at Rhodes Barn, where earlier this evening the yearly Carpenter High Halloween dance was held. We're trying to find out any information we can to pass along, but authorities are being very tight-lipped at this time. However, we did overhear one detective refer to the crime scene as a bloodbath. As you can see behind me, investigators continue to gather evidence at a crime scene we can only imagine to be horrific. One can only speculate the events that led to such a brutal and bloody night. I'm stuck here until I don't know what. Hey, Silas. Hi, Benny. That pumpkin looks amazing. You're gonna win that Xbox. I won't win. Oh my god, you won't win too? I think I'm going to paint mine. Should be home soon. I don't know how much longer I can take this. He really creeps me out. I'm home. Mama! His mom's finally home. I'll talk to you in a bit. Thanks. See you tomorrow. I carved my pumpkin. Show me. That's beautiful. Benny's is nice too. Great job. Who wants some ice cream? I do. I have to get going. Can I leave my pumpkin here? I'll finish it later. Why? It's yours. I'm afraid the kids at Ridgeway will smash it. Of course you can, honey. Thank you. I'll take a rain check on that ice cream. Sorry, Baba. Tell me what? Well, I was going to wait until it's official, but since a certain someone can't wait, I guess I can tell you now. I finished filing the paperwork today. What paperwork? You're going to be my sister! <gasps> if that's okay with you. You look great. I'm Scary Pumpkin. What are you? I'm a fairy witness. Come on or we'll be late. What's your hurry? Move, Sean. I just want to see what the loser has in the wagon. This looks really good. Yeah. A lot better than yours, Sean. You trying to win that Xbox? My dad stayed up all night carving my pumpkin so that I would win. Leave him alone, Sean. Then go tell your mom and dad. She can't. She doesn't have any. You ain't winning nothing. Is your name Sean? Sean. Well, we were just playing around and we accidentally broke Silas's pumpkin. Did you apologize? We were just about to. Go on. Sorry, Silas. It was an accident. He's lying. He broke the pumpkin on purpose. Now, why would he do that? Because he's jealous. <laughs> I highly doubt that. Get moving. It's OK. We will tell the principal what happened. No? Okay. What do you want? My pumpkin? You want my pumpkin? 
Okay, you can have my pumpkin. What you doing? We're gonna be late. Silas? Silas? Fine. You look awesome. Um, thanks. I meant your costume. Your costume looks awesome. Rodney and Chloe sitting in a tree. You're so immature. K-I-S-S-I-N-G. Well, you guys shut up. Can't believe that idiot won that Xbox. Me neither. I'm taking that Xbox. What if Mom finds out? She won't if you don't tell her. I thought I told you I was winning that Xbox. You're dead. Run! Sean, just let it go. I'm not letting anything go. Silas? They're over there. I'm going to get help. Where do you think you're going? Silas fell down that hole. He needs help. Do you think we're stupid? He's hiding. He's probably hurt. Now move. Let go of me. Penny! Silas! We have to get out of here. Come on. We have to help. Do you want to go to Juvie? No, but we can't just leave them down there. Yes, we can. Come on. Ms. Cochran and I would like to thank you all for coming out here volunteering your time to assist in the search for her son, Silas, and his friend, Penny Doyle. Where's Josh? I don't know. He's gonna tell. No, he won't. Oh, shut up. We need to be determined in our efforts to locate these children. We need to search every inch of this town. Let's find these kids. He's gonna be all right, I promise. I will not rest until he's home safe in bed. Thank you, Sheriff. This isn't good. I'll take care of it. What's he doing? Miss Cochran? Yes, dear? Me and my friends were wondering if we can have some flyers to put up. Of course you can. We're going to do all that we can to help find Silas. That means a lot, thank you. Take these and spread them around town. Everything will be fine if we keep our mouths shut.
ladies and gentlemen, the Carpenter High Huskies! Four years ago when I took over as coach, this was the worst football team in the state. I knew I had more work cut out for me, but I felt I was up for the challenge. I knew I couldn't do it alone. Fortunately for me, I was joined four years ago by a young man. A young man who I know had the talent and the leadership to guide this team. And today this young man has our team one win away from our first state championship. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you three-time All-State quarterback, Sean O'Brien. <laughs> Uh, thanks, Coach, but you know I couldn't do it alone. Give it up for my teammates! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> All right. Like Coach said, we have one game left. One game to prove we're the hardest working team. One game to prove we're the best. One game to prove we are champions! Let's go Huskies! <laughs> for the soon-to-be state champions. Thanks, Sammy. So, how far is it? Not far. It's the perfect spot. See, I told you it was the perfect spot. It's not bad. I was just hoping the view would be a little bit better. The view's perfect from where I'm sitting. Pictures taken for the paper. Where's Sean? Oh, he's still gonna interview when we got. Yeah. No. Aw, back so soon. Slow and steady wins the race. Oh, I ordered for everyone because I was starving. That's why I love you. Everyone's set with their costumes, right? I still can't believe I agreed to do this, man. We're gonna look so ridiculous, man. <laughs> Speak for yourself. I always look good. Guys, we all decided to dress as a group. It's a little late to be complaining now. Besides, I think you're gonna look adorable. All I know is my outfit's hot. You can wear anything and look hot. It's hard to believe this is our last Halloween before college. Maybe for you guys, because I'm not going anywhere. See, after we win that championship next Saturday, I'm going to be a legend. And I plan on taking advantage of that as long as I can, so. Who's gonna be a legend? I mean, you know what I mean. Kids, relax. We're all gonna be legends after next Saturday. We're going to own this town. Oh, who gives a shit, guys? The game's still a week away. We have tonight to focus on. You know, it's too bad we didn't get a party at Wendell's farm. My sister always talked about how great the parties were there. What's Wendell's farm? Some creepy old place that burned down when we were kids. That reminds me, I may be a little late to the party tonight. Why? It's not a big deal. Just have a little surprise for everyone. Ooh, I like surprises. Hey, Dracula. <laughs> hey, dickhead. Leave him alone. How's it going, Josh? Hey, Sean. You going tonight? Of course. Dracula loves Halloween. <laughs> but why do y'all still associate yourself with that weird owl? Same reason I still associate with you. We got a lot of history together. Whatever, I'm gonna go take a piss, all right? What kind of history? Can I get you guys anything else? 
No, just the check. All right, guys, let's go get ready. Sophie, I think I'm gonna walk. It's a beautiful day. Are you sure? Positive. All right, we'll see you tonight. What the hell, guys? You left me with the bill. Get over it, you jag. Shotgun. Bullshit. I paid. I got shotgun. Yo, bad. Should I give Rodney some money? Oh, don't worry about it. He's fine. Now, uh, about tonight? Bet you thought I forgot. I was wondering. How could I forget? One year ago today, I convinced you to go out with me. More like begged me to go out with you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay, fine, open it. It's beautiful. Just like you. I gotta run, I'll see you tonight. Damn it, Josh, you scared me. Why do you hang out with them? Because they're my friends. You don't know them. And you do? You haven't hung out with them for years. You've only known them for a year. You don't know who they really are. What you're seeing is fake. You don't know what you're getting yourself into. I think I have a pretty good idea. No, you really don't. Let go of me. You're making a big mistake. What are you doing here? Laundry day. Didn't you move out? Well, yeah, but mom's cheaper than a laundromat. Nice pumpkin. Yeah, I guess. You got one, too. Who made them? I don't know. I'm gonna go get ready for the party. Why are you telling me? Damn. Fucking Sean. Hey, girl. I'm glad I got my library card, because I'm checking you out. Hey girl, I don't normally date models, but here's my number. Hey girl, you must be Google, because you have everything I'm searching for. Hey girl, I like your face. Hey girl, are you from Tennessee? Because you're the only 10 I see. Yeah. Hey girl, do you believe in love at first sight, or should I walk by again? I'm leaving. I don't care. Dustin? Very funny, asshole. Meet you in that place up on the island. Chloe? 
we? Yeah. Can you come here, honey? What? How was the photo shoot? Fine. Did they ask you a lot of questions? I guess. Is there something you wanted because I really need to get my stuff together and get over to Amy's? No, I just wanted to catch up with my little girl. Is that a crime? Can I go now? Oh, I almost forgot, sweetheart. Someone left you something very interesting. It's on the dining room table. Where did this come from? No, no, honey. Yeah, man, hey, tonight's the night, man. I'm getting Chloe tonight. <laughs> hey, speak of the devil. Hey, Chloe, what's up? I'll tell you what's up. Some asshole sent me a creepy clown pumpkin. You're kidding me. Do I sound like I'm fucking kidding? Hey, Cl Chloe, calm down. It's, I'm, hey, I'm sure it's nothing. It's... Hey, Chloe, I'm gonna call you back. What the fuck is going on? This is what uh, Chloe was talking about. Yeah, I'm willing to bet Amy and I have one waiting for us too. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab my stuff and get ready at your house. Hello, boys. What's up, Dad? Hey, Mr. Riffle. <laughs> you boys heading out to the dance tonight? Yes, sir. Do we need to have that talk about responsibility? No, sir. No drinking, nor do we get in the car with someone who's been drinking. Now, that's what I like to hear. I'm going to go um, grab my stuff. Yeah, right. sure. Hey, um, do you have a moment? Sure, son. What's on your mind? Well, I'm sure you know what today is. Of course. Darkest day in our town's history. I just remembered how scared we all were, you know. No one ever figured out what happened. Well, there were theories, but nothing concrete. It's like they just vanished. It still haunts me. Yeah, us too. I'm all set. Have fun tonight. We will do. Thanks, Sheriff. What the? What the hell is? Damn it! What the fuck? So you're saying I don't have a shot with Chloe? No. I'm saying you almost got me shot. Concentrate on the game. What up, Stardace, nerds? Coming in hot. You guys flip burgers for a living now? Oh, oh scoot over. <laughs> Dude, I'm the greatest wingman ever, and I couldn't even get you Chloe. Besides, she's into me anyways. You two are both delusional. Chloe's way too hot for you two assholes. Excuse me? Have you not seen what I'm working with here? Oh, guys, you're killing me over here. Use your grenades. I'm talking about with Chloe, you dick. All right, listen. You want to get with Chloe? Here's what you do. Bang her best friend and make her jealous. <laughs> best friend's my little sister. And? Don't make me have to kill you. 
All right, play time's over. You guys see that tool Sean telling me he owes me 50 bucks. Boop, boop. Oh. Hasta luego, bitches. Such a deuce. Uh-huh, definitely. So, you have your eye on anyone tonight? No, thank you. I think I know who has his eye on you, though. Can we please not talk about this? Oh, come on. Look, Rodney's a great guy. Give him a shot, he might surprise you. I'm not saying that Rodney isn't a great guy. We just want different things. I want to have fun, and he wants a girlfriend. We look hot. Damn straight. Maybe you are too good for Rodney. <laughs> Come on, they're waiting on us. Where's Sean? I don't know, probably getting his surprise ready. We need to talk about these pumpkins. All of us got one. My sister got one too. So we need to figure out who's been doing this. No, I bet you it's Josh. Have you heard from that creep show? Not since the pizzeria. Then there we go. That's who's been doing this. No, guys, that doesn't sound like something he would do. Bullshit! He hasn't been right since the accident five years ago. Eight. What? Eight years ago. Whatever. All I know is that after that night, he got real weird and started drifting off. Yeah, well, you're always picking on him. That doesn't help. Wait, so this is my fault. But what if it's Sean? Hey, don't even. Oh, come on. Don't be stupid. Ever since that day, he's been Mr. Perfect. He goes above and beyond to be nice to everybody and be everybody's best friend. It's sickening. And he did say he had a surprise for us. Maybe the pumpkins are the surprise. Maybe he's finally giving in to what he did to those kids. Guys, back off. He wouldn't do this. Look, you don't know what that night did to him. I do. And ever since then, he's done everything he could to make himself a better person. Besides, I was with him all day, so it couldn't have been Sean. I'm telling you guys, it's Josh. Look, I don't care who the hell it is. I just want to go to the party and have a good time. This is obviously someone's sick idea of a joke, and I'm not going to let it bother me. Let's go get Sophie. Hey, hey, we need a ride. Sorry, no room. Damn it. So how are we going to get to the party? I'll just call one of my ladies. So we're walking. Every time. You all right? Oh, so we're talking now? Look, I'm sorry about earlier, but you scared the shit out of me. Yeah, whatever. Why are you alone? Get ditched? Chloe's picking me up, but I didn't want to be around my parents for another second, so I left. You going to the party? Do you think it's Josh? Probably. You know, I wouldn't put it past that weirdo. He's such a creeper. Didn't you notice how he follows Sophie around even though she's with my brother? So, Speak of the devil. What do you think they're talking about? Who cares? I want to get to the party. Oh, there's my ride. Are you okay? Good. See you at the party. <laughs> Hey y'all, how you doing? This is DJ Plasma and welcome to the Carpenter High Halloween Dance. Wow, ladies, looking good. Please help yourselves. Where did you get all of this? Dean hooked me up. Dean? He's home? Nobody tells me anything anymore. Dean's here? Let's go inside. Can I talk to you for a second? Absolutely. Hey guys, I'll catch you on the inside. So, you guys have been acting really weird all day? Well, it's not like we're excluding you from anything wonderful. Okay, okay. Um, today is the anniversary of when two of our friends went missing. Oh. Who were they? Their names were Silas Cochran and Penny Doyle. The whole town went crazy looking for them. No one knows what happened. 
What do you mean? They were never found. Oh my God, that's horrible. I'm sorry, I was being a bitch. No, no, you weren't, but hey, let's go have some fun. Looking good, Sean. Hey, Principal, looking good yourself, man. You two have fun, but not too much. Big game, man. You got it, man. You try so hard to get it right. So many honey, so little time. Seems too good to be true. She's ready to spread. Does anybody see Josh? Who cares? We need to find Dean. Dean? You really want to hook up with my big brother? Hell yes, he's fucking hot. Ew, gross. Go, just go. Sean, where's Dean? Uh, you can't miss him. Sometimes. Hey, dude. Dude. And you really need to tell her how you feel. Fuck this, man. I'm about to get some of the joint. Oh, enough with this drama. Come on, let's dance. Hey, you two go on ahead. I'm gonna make sure Rodney doesn't do anything stupid. Don't be long. I won't. Fun. Things were cool, things were great, it's so wide, you have to fly. song we celebrate and yeah all night long see i don't care that the bar is closing straight mark baby i'll get you open. okay tell the dj that i've arrived all the party people get your hands up high when i hit the stage shit's getting live so confident i don't need to lie nah i'm the life of the party bro i got girls topless like marty bro <laughs> Good God, she a dirty whore. I think I seen her on the Jersey Shore. Filthy, creepy, weird, filthy, creepy, weird, filthy, creepy, weird. <laughs> Everybody fist pump. They're telling me the bar is closing, but I don't want to go home. Don't want to go home. The music's blasting, drinks are flowing, so I don't want to go home. This next song is a special request. Hello, ladies. Hi. Next weekend, state championship. You girls going? Of course. Nice. <laughs> you can cheer for me when I score the game-winning touchdown. What position do you play? Quarterback. Isn't Sean O'Brien the quarterback? Well, yeah. But I'm the backup. I'm the, the punter, too. <laughs> Whatever. After next weekend, I'm going to be a champion. Carpenter High football rules! <laughs> That's right. Recognize. Whoa. Scary costumes. Damn, I'm empty. Silas?
your looks are like the sunset and a, a drink of margarita. Whoa! Hey, what's oh, the hurry? Oh, shut up, bitch. Hey, asshole, watch your mouth. I'm sorry you can't get laid up in oh. college and you gotta come back here and troll. Well, come on, man, you can do better than that. Fuck you. Listen, uh, asshole. If I were you, um, I'd shut my mouth uh -huh. and head back to the party. What do you think? And why is that? What, you gonna beat my ass? If you don't move along, I will fuck you up. Hey, 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 chill the fuck out. I better talk to your friend, Sean. Fuck you, dude. Hey, stop. Just stop. We got more shit to worry about. Better listen to your boy. Hey, just go. Come on, babe. Just go. Hey. Come on, man. Why'd you stop me, man? Because I don't want my brother to kick your ass. Yeah, whatever. We need to find Josh. I think he finally snapped. Keep him close. I'm not... Chloe, I'm not kidding. I can see your eye through that thing. Keep him close. I have a huge surprise for you. You're not even going to believe it. Why did you park so far away? You think I'm gonna park my baby next to the riffraff? Stay, right, stay. Stay. Keep close. All right, you can open them. It's nice. It's pretty amazing, but it does have its bells and whistles. Put them in. Door, gets a little jammed. Just wait until you see the inside. How romantic. Uh -uh. You gotta be this tall to ride the game machine. Watch your step. As soon as this, about to get hot in here. You in a tie-dye? Because you seem like a girl that I would to die for. Just, Just to shut be up. on top. Come here. Come here. Come. What the hell? Hey! Hey, asshole! Why'd you stop with the shaker? I'll kick your ass! Will you go do something? Josh? I don't think he's here. You are a lifesaver. Hey, take it easy. <laughs> hey, you too. You want anything? I can go get it. Oh, no, we're good. May I have this dance? Mr. and Mrs. Perfect. You sound jealous. Jealous? I mean, he's only the star quarterback and the team captain. You know, we got straight A's, beautiful girlfriend, everybody's best friend. Like, what is there to be jealous about? Try to get something to drink. You having fun? Yeah, I love Halloween. It's the one day of the year where it's okay to be scary. Mm -hmm. And slutty. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Definitely slutty. Mm -hmm. But not you. You look great. I'll never understand how I got so lucky. I couldn't agree more. You are very lucky. 
Now, before we play the next track, I want to call up my boy, Sean O'Brien. Sean, where you at, man? Well, come on up, man. Say a couple words. Get up there. What's up, man? All right. I hope everyone's having a good time. <laughs> all right, all right. Do you think you're having fun now? Just wait until the party that's gonna happen after we win next week! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> now, as next weekend approaches, it is important... Can we talk? In a minute. No, now. Get off of me! Hey, calm down! Hey, shut the fuck up! Where's Josh? I don't know! Bullshit! He's telling the truth. We haven't seen him since we left my house. Wait, wait. You saw Josh tonight? Yes, he was standing outside of Silas's house. Sophie! No, 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 let her go! Why didn't you tell me that you saw Josh tonight? I guess I forgot. Great. Now who knows where the fuck he could be? <laughs> How bad was that speech? Where's Sophie? Don't worry about Sophie. Amy just told me that she saw Josh at Silas's old house. What was he doing there? He was just standing outside talking to Sophie. Talking to her about what? I don't know. Oh, this is great. This is fucking great. I'm sorry, I didn't think. Well, no, you did not think. That's not what you did. You should have called him the second you saw him. You know this. You're fucking useless. You? You go look for Josh if you find him. You call me. You call everyone. I'm tired of doing this shit alone. I'm, I'm going to go to Silas's house, see if I can find Josh there. This ends tonight. We need to talk. You shouldn't be here. Everybody's looking for you. There you are, asshole. What is your problem? You're my fucking problem. That prank that you pulled today is not funny. What the fuck are you talking about? The pumpkins you left us jerk off. Look, I don't know what you're trying to do, but I'm not going to let it happen. Look, I didn't leave any pumpkins. Bullshit! Listen, alone. I don't want to fight. Yo, Johnny, stop. Break it up, now! Calm down this instant, or you won't play next Saturday. What, you ain't in charge of me, coach is. Oh, really? Yeah. OK, listen up. Party's over. You can all go home now. Except for you. I just found my cleanup committee. How's that for being in charge? So I gotta clean that whole barn by myself? Not my problem. Have fun. Great. Fucking great. Don't worry, I'll help you. <laughs> Wait, you're not pissed at me? Very, but I'm not gonna leave a friend hanging. Okay. I'll call everybody and tell them to get their asses up here. Good luck getting signal. Yes, dear. I'll, I'll be home soon. No. I, I don't know how much longer. Fine. I'll stop on the way home. OK. Bye. What a bitch. Fucking voicemail. Hey, Sean, come back to the barn. Oh, yeah. I found Josh and I kicked his ass. Yep. Piece of shit. Is that you, Josh? Oh, you came back for more, huh? I'm ridiculous costume skin. <laughs>
I tried calling everyone, but there's no signal. Figures we get stuck doing everything. Are there any more bags? That's gonna get full. Yeah, you know what? I think I saw some outside. Come on. Hey, is that Dustin? I think so. It looks like his costume. Idiot's probably passed out drunk. Come on, let's go scare him. Hey, asshole! Oh my God! Don't stop him! Don't touch him! I have to see if he's okay! Look at him, he's dead. We need to find help. I found this in the woods, covered in blood. What's going on? Don't come near us. What do you mean? Wait, you think I did this? Where's Rodney? No, I don't know. I was just walking in the woods after the fight, and I, I heard this uh, beeping noise, and I found Rodney's phone in a pool of blood. No way. You did this. Stay away no. from us. Run! <gasps> wait, wait. I left Chloe's keys in the barn. We have to get out of here. Sophie, no. It's Josh. It's Josh. He's gone crazy. He's killed Dustin. Possibly Rodney. Whoa, whoa, wait. Where, where, where's Sophie? <coughs> no, Sophie! <coughs> Sophie, where are you? Sophie, are you okay? Oh, God, you're blind. Okay. He ran off. When he heard you coming. Okay, well, we're gonna get you out of jail, okay? Sean, Sean. Behind you. What? No, please, no! Sophie, no! Miserable piece of shit. What have you done? When I get loose, I'm gonna kill you, you hear me? You fucking hear me? Josh, Josh, please let us go. Please. <laughs> this is insane. Why, why, why are you doing this? I. I know you felt guilty all those years, man, but but this isn't worth it. This Do it! What the fuck are you doing? Kill him! I'm sorry. I am so sorry. Don't apologize to them. You should be apologizing to me. What, but I did everything that you asked. If you didn't tell anyone that me and Silas were in that hole. But, no, no that's not possible. Wait, what are you talking about? Try to follow along, sweetie. I'm the girl that you put in that hole eight years ago, ring a bell? No. No, it can't be. So, so, baby, I don't know what Josh told you or how he's trying to manipulate you. Manipulating me? You are slow. Josh, would you like to tell them? No? Maybe it's better they hear it from me. Earlier, I bumped into Josh and we had a little chat. You going to the party? No, I'm going home. I beg to differ. You're going to the party. Why would I do that? Because if you don't, your mother dies. 
If you don't do exactly as I say, she's dead. Give me your cell phone. I don't understand. Give me your fucking cell phone. Here. That's a satellite phone. It's locked so you can only get calls from me. And what's to keep me from telling the police? Go ahead. Then the crackhead I hired to babysit your mother will kill her. If he doesn't hear from me every hour, she's dead. It's surprising what people will do for a couple hundred bucks. Do you really want to risk that? What do you want from me? It's very simple. There's a costume waiting for you behind the barn in a barrel. All you have to do is put it on and make yourself seen, and I'll text you further instructions throughout the night. Understood? Oh, there's my ride. Are you okay? Good. See you at the party. You killed your friends? For what? No, I didn't kill anyone. He's right. I did. The nice one. Hello? Yes, you can let her go now. I'm not a monster. Okay, it's story time. And it's similar to yours that you told me earlier, but mine is going to be truthful. Silas? Wake up. Silas? happened? It's okay. I'm going to take care of you. It's so cold. I want mama. I know. We will see her soon. I promise. It's so cold, Penny. It's going to be okay. You are a good big sister. Silas? Silas, no. No, Silas, no. No. That was the last thing he said to me as he died in my arms. We were in that hole for days, and all you had to do was tell someone. I'm so sorry. Shut up! I don't want to hear your apologies. After Silas died, I was in that hole for what felt like an eternity. Help me! Please! Hello? Help! Help! Please! Help me! Please, help me! Help! help. Who's down there? Hello? Hello? Are you hurt? Can you climb a rope? I'm not strong enough. Okay. I'll throw down a rope with a noose tied in it. You slip your legs through and sit in it like a swing, you understand? I think so. Here it comes. You ready? Uh, take small sips. You'll get stomach cramps otherwise. Silas, Silas is still down there. There's somebody else down there? 
Hello! Is he unconscious? He's dead. Is he your brother? He was gonna be. His mama was gonna adopt me. Adopt? Where are you living at? Ridgeway House. So nobody'd even miss you then. What do you mean? Don't you worry. I'll take care of you. Don't you move. <laughs> Go back in that hole? No. Then shut up! Have you seen these children? No, ma'am. Can't say that I have. Sorry. Okay. Thank you. So close. All I had to do was scream, but I couldn't. I heard Mrs. Cochran shot herself soon after that. Another person dead because of you. This is not my fault. Let's see if you still feel that way after I finish my story. to me, I'll be nice to you. If not, you're going to end up back in that hole. Do you want that? That's a good girl. I don't think you need me to paint a picture of what he did to me. And every time he came for me, I didn't blame him. I blamed all of you. You were the reason I was being raped on a nightly basis by that toothless piece of shit. And I didn't fight him out of fear of being put back into that hole, so I dealt with it. For months, I endured. I even pretended to enjoy it to lull him into a false sense of security, and it worked. One night, he fell asleep before tying me up. remember each blow with the sickle. The sound it made, the look on his face. I thought I would feel joy, but I just felt empty. I felt no satisfaction watching him die. It was like watching a pile of leaves blow away. And that's when it was clear to me what had to be done. Because all of you were to blame for what was happening, and I needed retribution. That was the only way to make the pain go away. 
so I began preparing for this day. And I assumed a new identity, and I enrolled myself in your school just to keep tabs on you. That's impossible. Not really. Wendell didn't have any family, but he had a lot of money. You'd be surprised how easy it is to buy a new identity. You're never going to get away with this. It doesn't matter. I've resolved myself to the fact that this is an all-or-nothing proposition. Let Amy go. She, she, she didn't have anything to do with what happened to you and Silas. It's me you want. Nice try, but she's just as bad as you. Sophie, listen. We spent a year of our lives together. We, we, we spent so many beautiful moments. This can't be how you really feel. I, I looked it in your eyes when, when you said you loved me. And I felt those words in my heart. And I, I meant it when I said I loved you too. Oh. Isn't that sweet? You have feelings for me. If only you had feelings eight years ago when I watched my only friend die in my arms. All those times we were together, it was just to get to this night. Every time you touched me, my skin crawled. I wanted to vomit every time we kissed. But it's worth it. Because now you get to pay for what you did. I don't believe you. I, I, this can't be how you really feel. I, if, if you've ever felt anything for me or Amy, you won't do this. Well... In that case... Ah, no! Oh! No! Oh! No! God! No! <laughs> so sorry. I love you so much. You fucking bitch. You killed my sister. How is what I just did different from what you did to me in silence? If anything, I was being more humane. But now it's just me and you. And I've been waiting all night to get you alone. You've taken everything from me. So I've taken everything from you. Look at her. Look at her! <laughs> your fucking fault. <laughs> what are you waiting for? You killed my brother. You killed my sister. Please, just kill me. No. I want you to suffer like Silas did. Like I did. I want you to think of all the people that are dead because of you. All the lives that are ruined because of you. What are you doing? <laughs>
tend.